Hello everyone and welcome to this mod tutorial thing. Um, today I'm doing the Schematica mod and it's a really really nice mod if you like to build things. Um, yeah what this mod does is just uh, when you've got like for example this house it's just a regular house from a village. Um, I think yeah I want this house also over here. You can you could of course do this and then go over here and just count one two three four five six and blah blah and uh, etc and yeah but it takes a lot of time you can also use world edit and just copy and paste this um, you could do that but yeah I don't know and so well the schematic mod makes it a lot of, uh, a lot easier to um, rebuild or yeah build multiple uh, things well uh, build the same thing multiple times and yeah well first go to your controls because um, I've made some different uh, keyboard points uh, for the schematic schematic mod for example load schematic is now on my number one so and you can make it I don't know which what are the normal key points but uh, you can make it one or uh, make it an uh, I. It doesn't matter. But um, when I say I press two, for example, to save schematic, um, it might be an uh, another button on your keyboard. Yeah. So keep that in mind. So um, yeah. Now we're gonna open schematic mod. So I will press two, and I will get this men this menu. Um, yeah. Here you um, enter your your coordinates on the place where you are you can uh, edit at 5 at a time, at 50 at a time, at 50 at a time, at oh, yeah, 250 at a time um, but the easier way is of course to just press red point and these are my coordinates over here on this block and yeah so this is the first corner of the area I want to highlight so that, that's what it's gonna do it's going to highlight the, thing, the place and so go for example go over here and fly a bit up because of course I want my roof also to be to highlight to be highlighted so um, over here I think and press 2 again in my case and I press blue point so this is the other corner then I go to enable to save the selection as a schematic so click enable and click and uh, just give the name for example um, uh, tutorial house all right and click save and just add click escape and you see over here there's a blue block thing so this is my this is a uh, corner number one or number two doesn't matter and this is corner number two or number one so this is the area you see maybe you can see it there are some green lines over here so you can see it's going to all the way up here and so it's making like a cube and that's good so just leave it there and just go to a place where you want to build it for example over here and then just press number one in my case it might be another keyboard uh, button on your in your case but and then just click the um, the file uh, your schematic file uh, you've just created for example tutorial house and click done and you see it's making like a ghost house so I can just fly through it and they're not they're not solid blocks or not real blocks uh, and now you can build it so just for example I take some cobblestone some wood some oak wood and yeah and some grass and just place the blocks uh, on the blocks it's in the ghost house thing like this and when you place a block over here for example this says it needs to be oak wood uh, lock it will be red I say hey this is not supposed to be here and you can just delete it and place the right block like this and yeah just make um, this is fast yeah you can just build a really 
nice thing really fast. I not so for example I made this wall and think well what should I do now all right over here and then you need to fly or walk every time over here so count one two three all right and then build over here it's really easy to do this way and if you press yeah in my case press three you open the um uh, what's it called uh, sorry sorry uh, manipulate schematic you open that and you can move your 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 ghost schematic file so for example oh it's now going down press up and i can move it that way and i can also move it to the side so you can just place it as you want for example think wow it should be turned so you can just flip flip so you can turn it um, this way or that way and you can rotate it like that and you can also hide it and show and move here for that's the place where I am but uh, oh, materials oh it's also showing uh, if you go to materials it's showing the materials you need for example I need 34 um, grass blocks 67 uh, cobblestone so if you're playing on survival if you're playing on survival and you got this mod it's also showing you how much you need or uh, yeah how much you need or from which material so it's really easy and really nice so well, I will just place it over here so press 3 and move here and it's over there and then you can just fill it in again um, another thing that yeah that might be a bit annoying if you well not really annoying but uh, if you, you know for example I click over here it won't let me place the block because because this is not uh, a real block it's a ghost block so I cannot yeah, place something underneath that I really need to go with uh, click on the solid blocks to place a block and yeah so you can really build some easy things it also works on servers and so if you see some someone building a really nice thing or a really nice spawn on the server you can just copy it and build it on your single player world or another place in the same server you can also build on your server but i think that's not what you should do because if someone built a really nice thing don't copy it and pay in build on your server i had some troubles with that before on my own server well yeah i don't really like that when people do the things but yeah so it's really 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 easy oh to um build houses or buildings like this way and uh yeah that's just basically it a really simple mod uh, to install it you need um, uh, Minecraft Forge link will be in the description also link to the page where I got this mod and yeah yeah that's basically it so uh, if you got some time left please leave a like it really helps me out and uh, I hope you you well download this mod and just play with it, just mess with it, just do some fun things and make some nice buildings and I will see you guys later. Bye.